before we do this, <laughs> the tale of two billionaires. I would like to welcome everybody back to Oh, How welcome. Is the crowd. Hello. Hello. I will Bien be let's start, let's start this again. We need to get kind of ener- energized. In I was energized. Huh. What? Okay, <laughs> welcome back to Fives the Crowd! Wow! Sorry, is that energy enough for you? I Sorry, like Tony. energy. <laughs> so energetic. <laughs> Are yours okay, bud? <laughs> what? <laughs> huh? Just kidding. <laughs> I will be your host for tonight. Um, I've got, surrounded by me, my four best friends that anybody could have. <laughs> Tony, Hello? Yep. Austin, yep. Chris, and Hello. Cam. Hey. hey! So tonight we're going to go back to one of our old podcasts that we did a little while ago. We're going to play a little card game tonight. Right. Um, I no, can't, I no can't tell objective. you. As you say, I can't tell you what tonight's going to bring, but we're going to have fun. And I hope you guys have fun with us. So here we go. All right. Uh, so this game is called, because I know we're going to get asked it. This one's called... Mind crushers. Mind crushers. We're gonna Mind. crush. Generally, you're supposed to lay out six cards, and the person with the coolest shirt starts and is deemed god. And that would be. And he me. clearly wins because he's. Ah, Dios. Pew 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 Dang. Hey, uh, if it isn't clear, <laughs> not safe for work. Put in your headphones. Yep. This not one says pretty kids. stupid NSFW. Yep. Yep. Yeah. Oh, I thought it meant Richard. <laughs> <laughs> so um, what, do, what do I do from here? I just read this. Yes, and, sir. And then we okay. talk about and it. Then and then we, we talk, talk about it. Okay. So Big Dick Airlines. Everybody say hello to Big Dick Airlines. Hello. 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 (laughs) Hi. It's an airline whose planes are shaped like big old dicks. Aren't they all? And the flight attendants attendants wear sperm costumes. (laughs) The luggage is stored in a day wing. (laughs) The luggage is stored stored in a dangling sack below the plane. Oh, my God. Are you the kind of person who would pay extra to ride the Big Dick? Extra? Heck no. Not extra. Not extra. If there is some kind of (laughs) discount. A dick count? <laughs> no. You know, I'm kind of, I'm kind of disappointed almost that it's not a boat. Almost worked. Because then they could be called seamen. Yeah. Uh, like a cruise line on a boat. Yep. I'm on a, a big boat. boat shaped like yeah, a dick. And the balls semen. just float behind. <laughs> <laughs> In the rudder. <laughs> <laughs> that way, if it hit a tight or it hit an iceberg, you'd have something to float on. Mm. <laughs> there you and go. it would make you limp. Yeah. <laughs> Take the boat lip. <laughs> <laughs> no? Okay. <laughs> Try. Uh, a lot of near near hits here. <laughs> oh, we're we're warming up. We're warming all right. up, all right? We'll get there. Oh man. All right. Is, is that what you tell Shaley all the time? I'm warming up, okay? I'm warming, I'm warming up. up. <laughs> Ten more minutes. <laughs> all right. Next one. Next one. So how do we pick the next player? So <laughs> The person who is God then gives the card to ah, the winner. Dios. And then the person who then receives the card picks the next card. Just say so. You know what? For for kicks and giggles, I'm going to say Cam. <gasps> he gets what else card. would it be for? I don't know. You get the big dick airline card. <laughs> <laughs> I win. Okay. Please pick. Oh, my goodness. And if you need a redraw, let me know. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> What's, I don't even know. Pant pan, pan, schism? Pan, 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 schism? Pan, pan, schism? Pan, 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 schism? I don't know how to say that know. word. I That's was intrigued when I saw it, though. Pan, I know. We had the same look. Pansychism? Pansychism? I have no idea. Right. Pansychism. Today I'm going to tell you about a cool philosophical theory. It is called pansychism. <laughs> I like it. It says that consciousness is a basic property of existence and that literally everything is conscious. It feels like something to be an electron whizzing through space. And it feels like something else to be a cloud drifting through the sky. It always feels like something to be anything. So do you find this theory comforting or horrifying? Do you think it's plausible? Do you get it? No. Wait, what? Everything has consciousness and feeling. And moves. So that microphone 
feels your hot breath upon it as you speak your <laughs> dirty words into it. It's bullshit. You know, would also be a feeling. When right. I was a kid, I would always feel guilty about throwing things away because I always felt like they had a consciousness to them. I and did then with you toys. Toys. And I, I would feel bad about throwing things away, like legit, because I'd be like, oh, this, they're sad. Like, I'm throwing them away. I, d- I did with toys. After That's Toy, Toy Story, Story. man. Yeah. I did. I had that. I think I've said it before, but it kind of the. I had the same thinking with like food. Mm-hmm. Like food's whole purpose was to grow up and to provide a delicious sustenance for me. Sausage so it's almost fest. like they were. Well, that's the thing is they turned oh, it into a movie. movie. Oh, but I've uh, never seen it and I don't want to. But see as it. a kid, I would like <laughs> as I would take a bite of food in my mind. They were like on the f- on the spoon, like yes, yes, here we go, like. <laughs> So or grateful. what if they're on the spoon going, no, dear God, please, no. <laughs> yeah. No, mine were always happy. Oh, okay. <laughs> Have you seen <laughs> that one where it's me. like, it's like uh, talking about a vegetarian and how they're like, I don't eat meat because it's just barbaric. And then it shows them eating a piece of broccoli and the like mom and dad broccoli are on the plate watching their son about to get eaten. They're like, no, <laughs> as he's putting the broccoli in his <laughs> mouth. <laughs> Dude, that's the thing, man. <laughs> Vegetarianism, it's a lie. <laughs> Did you ever see that meme out there or whatever it is? It's like, uh, you know, getting really suspect about these vegetarians and them trying to make all these beef patties that taste like beef. I've said that for years. Yep. <laughs> well, yep. I mean, all these, mad. Yeah, all these ground pat or whatever like, they no, are. No, no, no. If you don't want to eat the meat, you don't get the taste of meat. Yep. Well, a lot of them, if they're about killing it, okay. I hate this. <laughs> but here's the thing. Here's the thing. Monocrops kill more animals. Thank you. Than what? Monocrops, like corn, a filled corn field, right? Okay. okay. You're plowing it. You're killing all the rodents. You're killing all the voles. Lots of birds. You're killing everything to plant this. You're pesticide on everything. Yeah. Killing, which I mean, has a side effects of killing birds that eat the pest. Ain't nobody I, care about insects or anything. I kill it's all about one the animal. cows <laughs> and the deer and the it's elk. Like, it's like that scene from Yellowstone we've talked about, where he's like, he's like, why can't why can't we build there? He's like, oh, we're protecting the uh, sage, sage grouse. grouse. Yeah. It's like, well, don't you think that this giant solar field you're trying to build is going to clear out a lot of sage grouse? Like, where do you think the sage grouse? live well he says how do you prep the ground for the for the solar farm do you have and they're like well we clear the sagebrush he goes where do sage grouse live <laughs> so you're saying it doesn't affect exactly the, well there's no studies for it no evidence and studies he's like you're all fired <laughs> <laughs> do you even believe the words that are coming oh, out of your gosh. mouth right now yeah you're all fired. did you ever see just last thing on this did you ever see um there's a video of bear grills talking to somebody i can't even remember who the guy is but the guy asks him if he's he's like have you ever been vegetarian he's like that's a terrible diet yeah, yeah. he's like think about it he's like animals have claws they have teeth they have things to fight against predators a broccoli doesn't have anything to fight off predators therefore it fills itself with poisons to like protect itself and whatnot Oh and he like he goes into this whole spiel about all this stuff, and I'm like, dang, that dude could survive in the wilderness. I'm gonna listen to him. Interesting. The Bear Grylls was saying that. Uh-huh. Oh, he Bear said Grylls. he tried it, and he's like, nah, it's stupid. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, have I'll have to, to find it. It, it was good. I was like, dang, That's a okay. Thought, yeah. Mm-hmm. All right, big dog. Who right, are you to? Tony. Oh. Tony. Okie dokie. Ah. <sighs> See, that's mine. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, so these are basically just are they, well, like I'm trying to get the understanding of. They're just supposed the to spark the conversation. Yeah. Hot, That's it. Blow hot, your minds. Hot button toilet question. Mm. Okay. Love talking about toilets. This one tends to divide the room, so get ready. No. <gasps> when you've made a poo, and it's time to wipe. Do you stand up or do you remain seated on the toilet? Which method is superior? It doesn't really divide this room. No, it's but the day all the way. <laughs> <laughs> I still need one. Yeah, you, you do. do. <laughs> Bro, there's 60 bucks. 
No, it's not that. It's the fact that uh, like she's... I share a room with my kids, and one hundred percent they will play with it. Yeah. They will so, play with it one time. Yeah. That's what I told Jenny. I was like, "Let Reggie turn the knob once, bam, blast in the face." Yeah, exactly. <laughs> That's Never all it again. takes. <laughs> it's all it takes. Just gotta do it. <laughs> okay, so uh, I guess yeah, it doesn't work in this case. Well, for me, who does not have a bidet, I sit because for me, I feel animal. like it kind of helps spread the cheeks. Yeah, you, you could you can lean. You could say, Why? okay, say you're not at home with that with a bidet. You're out Ugh, and just, about. Uh, hold the poop in. <laughs> <laughs> That's not healthy. <laughs> it's to not protect healthy. itself, it creates toxins. <laughs> <laughs> it does, dude. Have you seen those toxic poop ads on freaking oh. YouTube? You got toxic poop. What? It's like they're trying to sell like fi- some fiber supplement yeah. or something. Okay, you know what I'm talking about? Clear you out, yeah. If I accidentally, ha- if I have to. I will spread my cheeks, sit back down closer towards the front of the toilet and go to the back because I don't want it accidentally hitting something on the way down as I'm wiping. I don't want it to hit the boys or anything. Poopy mm. toilet paper. I do both. Yeah. Either or. Just what I'm feeling that day. No, I got to sit. I, I just don't stand. Ergonomic See, but here's work. the thing. When you say stand, standing is also like not 100. Like, Pretty I don't clear know how, definition. Well, but I mean like it's not a clear picture. So like... For me, a stand is squatting but forward. Yeah. So m- everything's still spread. But, that, no, but I'm I just not fall leaning. on my face. <laughs> no, dude. You just like. No, I get what you're saying. Yeah, that's. You just yeah. that. Instead of seating, you're just like that. Oh, no. Too nah. much effort. I just, right. I just lean. I, that explains the chicken legs. <laughs> Thank All you. these years of squatting. <laughs> <laughs> Clydesdale. <laughs> They're so, open. like, you're not, like, standing up to, like, let the cheeks slap together and spread the mess. Mm. You know what I mean? But you're just, like, rocking forward off the, enough off your seat. Mm. I'll do both. I really don't. It's just whatever I'm feeling that day. To, oh, to yeah. get he, the job done. He just done. learned something new. He's like, I did. Oh. You get the job done. Interesting. <laughs> Provides easier access. You bend down, put your head between your knees, and you wipe back to front. <laughs> <laughs> with front your hand all the way front. <laughs> with your hand between your legs. Just <laughs> separate the boys. Wait, you really? <laughs> no. Oh, okay. I, was like, know, I, have a, I have a British friend who said that's how he does it. Gross. And he claims it's the best win. I'm like, so his mud flapper is real insane, dirty. Insane, yeah? dude. Yeah. Oh, bro. <laughs> Backside of the net sack is just darker than the front. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's like a spray on tan. <laughs> Cleaning Reggie's butt, I know how hard it is to get poop out of that gum sack. So, I mean, I, I can't imagine my adult one. That, that's awful. <laughs> Pressure wash that bad boy with a bidet. <laughs> <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we, we have that front setting on ours upstairs. I've never used it, but I've been curious before. <laughs> We've got a front setting on ours, too. Yeah. Kara's used it before, and then I've sat down and didn't know she switched it, and I turned on, I'm like, oh, shot right. Hello. <laughs> Mine's way too powerful. Like, I have to do the clean setting, <clears throat> clean it, and then I slowly have to turn the clean, even on the lowest setting of spray, to get it to where it's not feeling like it's going to rip my BH open. Dude, mine's. <laughs> <laughs> Same, like my the pressure to it is so high. Yes, it took me a while to figure this out. But the knob, I thought the knob was just like getting dirty or something because it wasn't turning that great. And it turns out it, it's just the pressure was so strong it was real hard to turn the knob. Right, that's yeah, and, and you it's can like, overdo it super fast. Yep, yep. oh yeah, <laughs> you go zero to sixty in a half a like no, no. slight turn. Here's an awkward. You're farting question. water out for a while. Have you got it perfectly aimed that it just goes straight up? Yes. Yes. Yeah. It does that on its own. Well, no, like, like how far are you we talking learn- enema style? Yes. Like yeah. a perfect aim where it just like you just turn it on without even thinking and it just and you're like, oh, <laughs> spit in water. It starts, yep. it starts gurgling. <laughs> <laughs> it, uh, yeah, because I, I've learned you, you want to relax a little bit. So you're getting everything. So mm-hmm. you want to relax it down there a little bit and just let it spray it all. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. I've used bidets before, so I know exactly what you're talking about. Dude, it's, it's, I think mine though, because you know how it has the notches the to get one angle. In the top, it has the notches, so you can line it up just right. I think mine's off by one notch, so it always hits just a little inside, so I never get the like ah. the goose. I just got my positioning down right, but it's like try, a woman trying to take off their lipstick. If they pucker their lips, you're not getting the lipstick off. You gotta relax a little bit. Let just let it go. 
Yeah, dude. Let it flow. It's, it's valid. I mean, it's a true point. <laughs> you got to you got to relax. <laughs> to get a, it's got to it's got to tickle and hurt a little if bit. Not, you know, you're you're gonna you're be, in there. It, yep. <laughs> exactly. Tickle not, and it, hurt. Got it. It's like <laughs> pressure. Yeah. It's like the turn you had dude, to cough, there's, Barry. There's another brand I really want to buy cuz they hook up to the hot water out of your sink. Yeah. yeah. My only problem is I don't want to have to run a uh, water line. I'm just used well, to it. Well, it it comes with it. I just mean like across the floor. Oh yeah. yeah. Or they make the one that like yeah. has it's like a hot water on demand, so you can yeah, yeah. charge it. It's got a battery and you can charge it, Good and it'll heavens. so it's battery powered. Yeah, but see, I don't even have an outlet near. Oh. What is it heating up? How's it heating it up? Because it's got a battery pack on like it's like fins. Yeah, hot so coil the water or goes yeah. So the water oh, goes through okay. it and it heats it up so you don't actually have. To I it's like a really, tankless water heater. <laughs> really, <laughs> yeah. There you go. But really, what, what we need yeah. Yeah. is a blow dryer in there. <laughs> I need to squirt it up and then just blow dry. Yeah, oh, I just yeah, use a, I just use a little toilet paper. Well, yeah, but to pat I mean, it dry. All the hair back. I there. want a blow dryer. <laughs> yeah, it's like one of those like really. It's like a like dog Dyson. Sticking, it's all three like D printed attachments. Stick a blow dryer on it. It's like a Dyson powered one. Yeah. Like bro, those, like those ones you put it your winds hands up in that like looks a like turbo. A it's yeah. like, bro, three yeah. D print like a reverse vacuum. So you just connect it to a hair dryer right next to the toilet. Yeah, exactly. And then you just turn on the hair dryer. Exactly. <laughs> we could have you could have different ducks, man, different angles. I feel like hair dryers aren't powerful enough. Oh, bro. <laughs> what? They're pretty strong. <laughs> no, it's been a while. I also have it, so. an electric like air duster. Stick <laughs> that bad boy on there. Just get your shop back. On yeah. Reverse. Really? <laughs> <laughs> Come out. It's like. It's like Soft. It's like it's got it's like those, those conditioner. Take those TV straight. shows. You know how you could comb your hair as you blow dry it and it goes straight. <laughs> your butt hair is just straight just, coming out. Like, no, dude, it's perfectly parted down the center. <laughs> looks like your butt ate a broom. Yeah. <laughs> just looks like freaking looks like paintbrush. a paintbrush. Looks, looks like, like a, a dad from the Adams family. <laughs> yeah, looks like a water down. buffalo is about to come out of your butt. Look like they're little. <laughs> Oh, oh my gosh! I'm it's past- like it's like in cartoons when they go into another room to do something, uh, like I don't know, like make a sandwich or something. But then they play all those like hardware noises. They come out with like a sandwich every time you go in the bathroom. That's the sounds that come out. It's a poop knife. Awesome. Like what are they doing there? <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna give this one to Chris because he seemed pretty passionate about that one. So passionate about poops. I did. We'd go poop master. Oh, oh you can pull from nope. there. Or I can. No, nope, let's see him. If you need more cards, feel free. There's no real rule to this game. Mm. Self love. Oh boy. Gross. <laughs> if you cloned yourself and you could change your clone's gender to whatever you'd like, would you have sex with your clone? Do you think you'd end up getting married? No. No. One hundred percent no. That yeah, <laughs> heebie jeebies. Have you? That, I do, that did not go the way I wanted. I mean, yes. here's the thing. I know what I like. <laughs> Zach, you're gross. <laughs> I was kidding. I just, everyone was saying no. I just wanted to be the yes, okay? <laughs> the way my brain went, though, is like when we've created female characters on like wrestling and things yeah. like that. I'm like, well, I mean, if I can pick and choose. Like, I mean, here's I the can thing. Pick and choose then, the parts but, and... but here's the question, though is you're cloning and changing the gender. Yeah, so it's exactly You're still looking DNA. at yourself going. You're still looking at yourself with like long hair and boobs. Mm-hmm. Hey, buddy. <laughs> I don't like this question. I hate no, it. No, no that, that's not how, how I How about it Chris to. do another one? So do you? I Please mean, do yeah, another I'm one. I'm not gonna say it. No, no, go for it. No, no let's go. You'll get you watch the boys. Anyone? I, you yeah, watch yeah, the little yeah. bit. I got. I stopped watching. I, they just too they're too far, way too much. But okay. there is in the second season, Homelander. The like he's basically the Superman, but yeah. he's a psychopath. He kidnapped a, ch- a shape shifting guy, and that guy pretends to be this other lady. But uh, the guy was afraid that Homelander was going to kill him, so he turned into Homelander, but he was wearing like a nightgown. 
and then he started making out with himself. And it was one of the most disturbing things I'd ever yes. seen. Oh, my goodness. Yes. What so, about the shrinking guy? Definite no. Do not ever <laughs> bring that up again. <clears throat> that is legitimately the reason I stopped yes. watching. Yes. Yes. The shrinking no more, guy. no more, because I've been wanting to watch this. I saw, I saw an Dude, it's, ad saying it's, that it's too much, man. It is. is it? I saw the line I've, in a horrific heard this way. New season's gonna get worse. Exactly. So, yeah, ever. I was gonna say I saw an ad saying that the new <laughs> I, season that they have something in it that is gonna be the most disturbing thing you've ever seen on TV. And, I don't know how and that's saying that. a lot. Yes. Jeez. Like it, on a scale of one to Game of Thrones, where we where we stand. Oh, well, bro, it's not it. even pa- like Game of Thrones isn't even visible. On the planet. Game no of Thrones way. is a children's Not even, show oh, yes. compared to that. 100%. Oh my Get gosh. out. Dude. Like, it literally, there are literally images that'll randomly pop into my head and it literally makes me just shudder. Like, I'm just like, ugh. Uh, yep. Like, I you regret gotta, ever seeing it. You yep. gotta really? tell, I, I'm oh, curious yeah. about at least one. You gotta say one. Off we'll camera. tell you off camera. Yeah. Okay. Wow, that's crazy. Mm. Tony, let's watch it. <laughs> 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 guys night, let's watch the boys. <laughs> You guys won't look it's at each other worth the same. same. Not I've only, <laughs> oh heck no! I couldn't even imagine watching that with someone. If I yeah, I've only seen the first season. I've so. only and I've only watched it alone because I won't you know. Oh yeah, that's, anyone else to watch it? Like watching can, the first season, like, why I haven't watched with anybody else. Turned it off or vice versa. You'd be like, why don't you turn this off? Please yeah. turn it off. Like I'd be sitting there. Please turn this off. <sighs> wow, okay. you've piqued my interest. Chris, do another one. No, I don't. So have I've to. seen some pretty jacked up stuff in my life. Oh, it's Austin's. Austin's turn. Yeah, me. Okay, go. This you got called? your favorite card. I mean, it's, I, I really only just like the beginning. This, this, <laughs> these four letters. What is it? it says he found the dildo. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's such a funny word. It is. <laughs> Pluralize it. <laughs> I always think of a dodo bird. <laughs> Bill does. Oh, they're uh, trying to bring them back. Anyways. <laughs> your four-year-old son found a dildo. It's yours. He took it out of your dresser and he put it in his own toy box. He loves to play with it. It's his favorite toy. It's big, floppy, and hilarious. Are you going to take your child's favorite toy away from him? Yes. 100%. Yeah. That's, oh, yeah. He never gets it. It's a lightsaber. I mean, it makes Gross. that sound, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> oh wait, that's a vibrator. This is a dildo. They, they could be both they, one and the same. Oh, gross! One of Ashley's mom's hairs. <laughs> is, it, it's, uh, is it Ashley Brittany. or Brittany? Yeah. Oh, gross! Oh, one dude, of Brittany's it's mom's, one of Brittany's hairs. mom's pubic hairs. <laughs> oh, that's a great psych out. Oh, dude, another one. <laughs> what is this? Uh, From basketball. Oh, I can't remember that. <laughs> it's like right at the beginning yeah, when they're, they're creating the game and they have to psych him out to make him miss the shot. And the guy's about to take a shot and he goes, oh, it's one of Britney's mom's pubic hairs. And the guy misses and his buddy's like, oh, that was a great psych out. And then he's like, oh, look, another one. <laughs> and he's like, <laughs> well, it started off, they go to a party at this girl's house that they kind of have a crush on. And they go into a room and they're like, oh my gosh, Britney's room. And then they go through that drawer and they open up the first one. And they're like, oh my gosh, Britney's vibrator. And the guy's like licking it and all this stuff. And all of a sudden the Britney, Britney. walks in. She's like, what are you guys doing in my mom's room? <laughs> <laughs> and he immediately drops the vibrator and you hear it just go. It hits the bottom of the wooden drawer and you just hear. <laughs> 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 Oh, I always oh picture a gosh. gas-powered vibrator. <laughs> gas. <laughs> it's like a chainsaw. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot to turn the choke off. How big <laughs> would that thing have to be? <laughs> All I can think of is that like m- massager thing that we saw. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I didn't know you could do that. <laughs> I didn't know I could do that. <laughs> <laughs> Honey, what? <laughs> that makes me think like steampunk style. Like it's a little yeah. steam engine. <laughs> it's got the wheels like... <laughs> <laughs> Steam powered vibrator. <laughs> I want to make that. Can we make? Can we make one? Choo choo. It's got a little tiny. <laughs> Add little more coal bell. to little the bell engine. on it. Ding. I think I can. I think I can. I think I can. <laughs> oh, that's great. That's awesome. <laughs> Oh. On a real yeah. note, yeah. on a real note, back to the question. I would take it away, but it would be when 
they're distracted. They're distracted, like, not noticing. Like I don't want them. Mm-hmm. It's just gonna disappear. I yep. replace it with a lightsaber. It's gonna magically vanish. Just replace it with one of those like water balloon things that's like kind of inside out of itself. Mm. You know what I'm talking about? Yes. yes. Well, then oh, you're connecting yeah. the dots. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, added, I added to the stack. Uh, has anyone not gone? Nope. 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 We've, We've all gone now. Gone. All oh, gone. We'll just go in the star pattern then. Zach. All right. Do that first one. That's <laughs> <laughs> Do Go it. for it. Go for it. Come on, you did a dick one last time. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Penile. There's one on here called The Field of Cream. Yeah. Oh, boy. <laughs> nice. Sorry. Oh, boy. All right. I want a new oh. card after this one. This actually pretty isn't. I don't know. Maybe Uh-oh. it will be. What's the picture of? Is that a chicken? Is that it's a, a rooster? Cock. That's a cack. <laughs> He's mad that he didn't connect the dots. Yep. Yep. <laughs> Especially before asking. Penile firmness. Is it possible for a penis to be too hard? I don't know. If it hurt, Wait, I was well, say, I think coming from a guy like my own, yeah, there's oh, been yeah, times I'm almost like, I'm like, all right, settle down, buddy. Holy <laughs> hell. It's straining like that kid in the meme. It starts curving, <laughs> looking for the weak spot. I start to wink. I went thinking the other way, though, for the woman. And I was like, well, think of what we just talked about. Some of those things are like hard plastic. What? Yeah, oh. that's true. Yeah, so that's I'm like, true. I guess not. <laughs> I mean, the. I think, yeah. The good toys, though, still have a bit of a sponge to it, right? I don't know. Let's go to the Amazon comments. (laughs) 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 On the male side of things, I know you've shared Mm. a story. I don't know if you shared it on the podcast. Oh, boy. (laughs) (laughs) I don't know if you want to share it. I won't force you. I don't know what you're talking about. It involves a ring. Oh, yeah. That. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah. You don't have to. You don't have to. Oh, I don't care. Um, <laughs> so, <laughs> oh, it's, it's in relation, right? It's can so, it get too hard? I would say yes, according to this story. Yeah. So, um, for those that haven't heard, there's a thing called a cock ring, and uh, <laughs> and we we had one one time, and we tried because it's supposed to make the man. Like harder and like hold. Yeah, exactly. So you can stay hard longer, (laughs) different things. First time we tried it, we did it wrong because I got hard first and then put it on Mm. and it didn't really do much. Second time we tried it, we did it correctly where you're supposed to put it on flaccid and then get hard. (laughs) Oh, my (laughs) hell. I thought the tip was going to explode. <laughs> like, I mean, like a hot dog on a grill. Like, I was just, oh my gosh. I couldn't get that thing off fast enough. I almost had to cut it off too because trying to like roll it off was like a tube of toothpaste. Like, I just, like, oh my. It was so painful. Got a rupture of vein. Oh my gosh. You almost have to like incorporate a, a relief valve or something. <laughs> Right. Oh. Like, like put a zip tie in there so you just like pull it to like look like a room. topographical map of the Nile River. <laughs> <Just> <laughs> put a pack of ice on well, afterwards. And <laughs> it comes so oh so it's kind of a thicker uh, thicker ring, and then it comes with a thinner ring attached to it. That if you want to, you can hook that part around your balls. <laughs> <laughs> but then, but it says like it's optional if you want to cut it's that optional. part off. And so, I, yeah, I wasn't even playing around with that one. <laughs> I, and thank goodness I didn't. Oh my god! That gosh. puts them right in the line of fire because it would pull them forward, right? Yeah. So if you're like really going, oh, yeah, that that's... freaking hurt, man. <laughs> that would be a nut shot every time. <laughs> yeah. get, some, get some together so you can put the condom over both. Easy. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh. Oh, oh my gosh, that's good. Just so you know, if you're offended by this one, go ahead and check out some of our others. They're very wholesome. <laughs> right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have some wholesome ones out there. <laughs> Somewhere. 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 We should have started the video. If this is your first time here, don't watch this. Go watch all the should've, good ones, then come back. Add should have said one on the, on the last episode, too. <laughs> hey, those are the greatest. Oh, yeah. They do get a lot of the popular votes. All right, Cam, you're everybody up. everybody nasty. <laughs> 
It's, it's all very related. Say so we do one more time around as far as. Let's see. Let's see. The dog hole. I'm <laughs> trying to spread them. Chug. Chug's bunny. <laughs> That's what she said. Did she? Chug's no, bunny. Really? Oh. She's trying to spread them. Ah. Oh. I was Austin like, said I'm trying to spread them, and I said that's what she said. I get it now. I get it. All right, Austin got it. I, mean, I got it. I mattered. appreciated it. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> you could put it back. Get a different one if you don't want it. No, he's got <laughs> it. <laughs> <laughs> All right then. Oh gosh, Chugs Bunny. Hey, it's me, Chugs Bunny, <laughs> the cartoon bunny who chugs milk. I'm always chugging milk in every scene. Bugs Bunny's got his carrot. I got my milk. I also love anal sex. <laughs> Chugging milk, anal sex. That's where it's at. You want to be my friend? <laughs> that's it. <laughs> that's it. What is that? That's not even a bunny. It's a freaking goat. <laughs> what the hell? All right, you can pull another one. <laughs> that is. The I guess the question was, do you want to be his friend? <laughs> but do you chug milk while oh, having it? <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, I see dig. one on there. I don't, like, I don't like the freaking goat ones anymore. Feel classic, Latella to Ben. Scorpion party. Ooh, do it. Get over so, here. Okay. <laughs> the scorpion party. Would you vote for a presidential candidate who agreed with you on all the issues, but just so happened to be a giant talking scorpion? <laughs> How did you Those get are these? very drastic <laughs> cards. What yes. Are you? Yes. All right, we're pulling yes. new ones. I like. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait, hang on. There's Would one. you? If you There's agreed with everything, in that deck that I'd be good to in see. a pinch. He's a giant. Right. He's a giant talking scorpion. He'd be good in a pinch and have some good points. Exactly. <laughs> you ah. are so dumb. I love it. But <laughs> Wow. Oh, like look at the pride on his face yeah, when he, he said He was happy about that He hit that, that one from both ends. Yeah, it's funny. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like an imaginary friend. <laughs> oh, you didn't have one of those? No. No, I had real ones. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right, whose turn? I want this one. All right, Tony's going. Just because it says it's controversial and not safe for work. I hate my childhood. Tell <laughs> <laughs> Right there. I'm the front bottom. Oh, I love oh, it. safe for work. <laughs> yeah, it says it on the front. <clears throat> it says, a way out of the draft. So. Oh. <laughs> Is it getting it's, worse? Change? It's dumb. <laughs> like, it's gross. This isn't controversial. Like, okay. Is <laughs> They would do it. <laughs> well, you have to. <laughs> <laughs> would you eat some lady's asshole to get out of the draft? I'd do it for free. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, Bro, oh. <laughs> it's better to eat that than what you might eat out in the field. Oh. I'm just oh. saying, are we talking cannibal I'd style? I'd go for gold, or? buddy. <laughs> go for gold. <laughs> Oh, it reminds me of a. Oh. Have you, it reminds me it's of like that, a doggy treat, right? <laughs> that Dave Chappelle stand up <laughs> when he's talking about living in Ohio, and some he's like this nasty, cracked out white lady comes up to me. She's like, "Hey man, you got like some money, man? I need to bust some drugs, man. I'll suck your dick for five dollars." And he's like, Ugh. Two. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Yeah. That reminds me of Jay and Silent Bob Strike Back. Have you ever seen that? Uh uh-uh. uh. They're trying to hitch a ride to Hollywood or something like that. And uh, they pass this other drifter on the side of the road. And he's holding up a sign that says, We'll suck dick for ride. And uh, Jay is like, at, He's like, Oh gosh, I can't remember the conversation. It's been forever since I've seen it. Um, but, uh, Jay's like, yeah, yeah, that's good and all, but what happens when you don't make with the head? And he's like, well, then you get your ass kicked if you don't make with the head. And they're like, oh, oh, like, they, like <laughs> I despised <laughs> those movies. <laughs> yeah, they were weird. <laughs> I did. I never saw them. I saw clips of them. I was like, Ugh. I just was like watching it. I like- saw that one and clerks one and two. I think those were the only ones of the like. 
universe that I saw. Oh, that okay. Of like yeah, the Jay and dude, Silent I Bob could, universe. I, 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 okay, I didn't. I just couldn't get into them. I just like, dude, where's my car? I would put that in the same category. Mm. Well, it's funny too because the guy who played Silent Bob was like, he's basically Not like Kevin Silent. Smith. Yeah, Kevin Smith. He's like the authority on all things comic books. Yep. Yep. Like such a he different is. world. Like, yeah. yeah. <laughs> now you owe me, owe me, owe. <laughs> mother, mother. <laughs> 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 All right, Zach, this one's for you because uh, you were I in one. So which, oh, yeah, you said oh, you were I went one. through and filtered them. I was I in one, but. Was there, is it in this list? Did he remove it? You removed it. You want another one? I don't know. Was it, it was Greg? that dog one. Dog one? Dog, dog hole? hole? Yeah. Is it which one? Dog hole. Keep going until you find the hole. <laughs> oh, it says it's tricky. pretty stupid. Well. I'll look over it. Go with Chris, because it's Chris's turn. Christopher! Hey, I'll look over it and see if it's worth. I'm just here for the party. Ooh, guns. <laughs> bang, bang, bang. Pew, pew, pew. It's got the goat. Pew, pew, pew. Bang, bang, bang. It's time to fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Jeez. Wrong kind of, wrong kind of bang. <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh God! Are you gonna uh, a grapefruit, a vacuum cleaner, or Mitt Romney? Oh my! Well, I'd I'd have the one with the soul. So the grapefruit. The grapefruit. <laughs> <laughs> <Damn it. laughs> the grapefruit. How does it have a soul? Oh, <laughs> it's a living animal plant <laughs> organism. It's a joke. I unintentionally already have to vacuum, so. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm sure as heck not going to have Mitt Romney when he's already hold on, after us. Hold on, hold on. We can't pass this. <laughs> I've Wait, told the story. Wait. I remember, but I don't remember you telling. Did you tell it on this? Yeah. Oh. Tell it I again. Can, tell it again. <laughs> we got new listeners. So, um, <laughs> I want to say, so I, I was, uh, I think it was when I was buzzing my head at the time. And I would buzz my head naked because I don't want to get <laughs> hair in my clothes and stuff. And Jenny was helping me. Drop the clippers, man. <laughs> <laughs> That's another story. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, yeah. I heard that story, too. Gosh. <laughs> and it goes a lot like this. Yep. That explains. Oh. oh, oh. That's yeah. right. That's you right. seized them. <laughs> oh. I, did. I, I mean. My palms started sweating. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Just now, like thinking about oh, that. Oh, yeah. Ugh. Mm. <laughs> but yeah, with the, with the vacuum thing. So Jenny's kind of helping me, and uh, she has the vacuum sucking up the hair off the ground, and, mm -hmm. and it kind of sticks to the hair on my leg. So she's sucking <laughs> she up that. She purposely did this. And she got a little too close and <laughs> <laughs> Dude, it hurt so bad. Well, the couldn't ring. shut that vacuum off fast. Enough. The the ring or the vacuum? Huh? The ring or the vacuum? Worse. Worse. Oh. <laughs> the vacuum ended faster. Okay. So. Here's a question: Did it come out longer? <laughs> well, asking, did asking you get an inch? It was twisted. <laughs> yeah, just. Uh, you were looking at the bottom. You were you were looking at the bottom side of it when it came out. Huh? <laughs> I, what I want to know is how bad was Jenny laughing? Oh, she was gone. <laughs> she, was she did that shit on purpose. <laughs> Most likely. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, next time we hang out, I'm calling her out on it. Just kidding. The, the, the thing, if I remember right, though, it didn't get the dick. It was just the boys. It was just, <laughs> oh, oh, that's yeah. not even yeah. worse. Yeah. Yeah. Even that's worse. Really it hurts. That. Oh, did they go God. in together? That's or did one go oh, <laughs> it's like, <laughs> <laughs> were they, I hear it now, were they crowding through the door? <laughs> Just the sound of the vacuum where it's like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, have you ever put the vacuum to like your cheek and it's like that? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> but it wasn't oh. like that at first. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> oh, shit. It all happened so fast. I blacked out for a moment. Like, it was so... Uh... <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> oh, Bryce, you're still here with us. <laughs> I, thought you, I, thought I ought to have died. 
Holy <sighs> crap. Uh, that reminds it, me. Have you ever seen that? It was at that moment a kink was born. No, I'm just kidding. I'm so kidding. The, so Mommy great, Daddy been vacuuming so long. <laughs> <laughs> Vacuum's clogged again. <laughs> <laughs> so the grapefruit one reminds me. I think Lisa showed me a video. This lady's like, have you ever been grapefruited? And she's like, does this tutorial where she cuts both ends of the grapefruit, puts it in the microwave. You don't want it hot. You want it just warm. And she, like, has something that she puts through it. And then all of a sudden, she's all... <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> what? What on earth? What just it happened? Wasn't anything. <laughs> <laughs> what? She's like, you don't want a hot... Like, you don't know what she's talking about. And all of a sudden, she puts something through the grapefruit. And she's all of a sudden, you just hear... <laughs> <laughs> what? I keep stopping what? at the part where I'm so confused. The thing she's putting through the grapefruit <laughs> is in place she of a wiener. Sucking on the thing. I can't remember what it is. <laughs> <laughs> she's putting the grapefruit on the dick. She's going for glory. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Why would you put on the like YouTube on there? It was a YouTube video. Oh my oh gosh, gosh, dude. And she's like, <laughs> <laughs> that reminds me of a. Uh, Good okay. luck, Chuck. I thought it was funny, but <laughs> have you I seen Good Luck, Chuck? Much. Where uh, he it never actually shows anything, but like earlier in the show, he talks about effing a grapefruit, and then later in the show, um, it's with Dane Cook. He calls up yeah. his friend and uh, and he's like, "Hey, what are you doing?" And he's like, "Oh, not much." And he's pulling a grapefruit out of the microwave, <laughs> and he's got one of those like corkers, like an apple corker, where it, and he's like, <laughs> like pops this hole out. <laughs> And you could tell what he's getting ready to do. Oh so this God. one is so funny because you have to watch it because you don't know what's going on. You like you don't know what she's doing with this grapefruit. You think that she's preparing something, I and know then what the you title like was. it's too late before you realize what's gonna happen, <laughs> and then it's just dramatic, like the whole. So that reminds me of a story my brother-in-law told me one time. He was having this conversation with all of his uh, coworkers one day, and he. Uh, he lays asphalt, so, you know, he's around all that, the construction types, you know, stereotype. And they're talking about creative ways that they've rubbed one out before. And uh, stranger, he said that his boss, uh, <laughs> his boss all of a sudden goes into this explanation. He's like, no, no, no. He's like, here's what you do. He's like, you go buy a large soda from McDonald's. And he's like... After you're done, you take the cup, you cut out the bottom. Uh -huh. He's like, you put one of those big, huge, like, sponges in it, fill it with, or he's like, cut a hole out of it, <laughs> fill it with some warm water. Then you take a condom, you cut the tip off oh. the condom, slip it through, and you snap the end on both ends. So now it's like, like, can he see where? He's made a flashlight. Exactly. Made for travel. Like, Basically a flashlight yet yeah, before they were around. Out of McDonald's. Out of a McDonald's cup. Oh my gosh. That's reduce, hilarious. reuse, recycle. <laughs> 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 uh. Holy crap. This podcast went everywhere. Yep. Hang on, we're not done. Right off the cliff. We got you to go. Me? Yeah, because yep. Chris just went. He did bang, bang, bang. Oh, snap. So bang, bang, bang. Spread them. <laughs> oh. I actually get to pick. <laughs> Streep tease, you need this job. The tale of two billionaires. The hot garbage. What do I want? Yes. No. Just <laughs> this one? <laughs> it doesn't matter. You go with what one? you want. <laughs> this is as controversial. Is it controversial? It says you really need this bit. job. It might be uh, for Zach. A little bit. Give it a shot. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You really need this job. You're at a job interview. You really, really need this job. Zach, I'm talking to you. Okay. The interviewer says, final question. What's wrong with giving a hand job to the horse I love? <laughs> 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 what? Come here, you stallion. Austin's eyes. What, what happened? Problem. Why did I pull this one? <laughs> That's what he That's said. That's what he said. Oh, <laughs> yeah! <laughs> the horse loves it. What's the problem? How will you respond? Zach, you're on the clock. <laughs> <laughs> it took him two hours to explain this. What? Oh. Wow. <laughs> and then say, I'm quitting. 
you're an asshole and I'm quitting or whatever you say. <laughs> this, yep. This reminds me. This reminds me of that one cartoon uh, thing where he's uh, when he's doing the job interview and they hook him up to a lie detector. And he's like, yeah, say something ridiculous. Like, oh, I got a 12-inch penis. And he's like, I got a 12-inch penis. And it doesn't do anything. <laughs> yeah. He's like, wait, really? He's like, maybe 13. Eh, no, nope, it's 12. <laughs> 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 that was one of the best ones. <laughs> <laughs> oh. So, I, I, Zach, answer the question. <laughs> You're on, you're in the interview. Uh, there's everything wrong with it. I wouldn't touch it. <laughs> I mean, it is how they breed them. Well, no, thank they you. They have a leather vagina. That it's they, true. They, they, they like did, it's a mock vagina. Did they say you they get ready to mount, and you hurry and shove that leather thing on, and then uh, no, <laughs> you got excited yeah. and then grossed out. Yep, like they shove them. <laughs> <laughs> Just the like worst. Just shove it right on and. <laughs> <laughs> the worst part is, is I've seen the very first one I saw. It's burned into my brain. Is <laughs> <laughs> this horse jumps up onto this other horse, and then you see this lady come out from outside of view. She just goes running in like a rodeo clown, grabs it <laughs> with her hands. I've seen wrestles, that video. Pulls it and then goes wham and slams it in there. I've oh, seen that video. Oh, oh my gosh, it totally catches Before you can click it off, it's all happened. And you're just like, oh, God. <laughs> oh, my <laughs> gosh. And it was like one of those videos where you weren't even expecting the horse. Like it, it had a misleading title. <laughs> it got me. It got me good. It was very unexpected. That's just it was where do champions, be, where do champions come from or something? <laughs> <laughs> How champions are born. <laughs> Oh my gosh! Oh gosh! So what? How do we respond? I'd be like, no. that's called bestiality. Yeah, freak. Yeah, no thanks. Ugh, is this a stud you're sense. breeding? Nope. I don't want to end on that one. That's terrible. all right. One more. I decided I don't want the job from you, horse. Is dog? this for scientific yeah. purposes? What was your dog hole one? That one was stupid. Okay. I'll read this one. The tale of the two billionaires. All right, yeah. all right. That was my second pick. That Says, intrigued me. Okay, two billionaires. One billionaire spends their money building big, dirty factories that spew ga bad gas all over the planet just to make more money. The other billionaire spends their money paying thousands of men to fill dumpsters with cum, oh. creating literal or cum dumpsters. Oh my gosh. All across America. I hate this. I hate all of this. I earned some of that money. <laughs> just, <laughs> just for no reason. Oh. Oh Which God. one of these terrible billionaires would you rather date? Date? Bring in. Yep, date. They could be women. Yep. <laughs> Think of them as women. Yeah. One spewing <laughs> bad gas all over the place. The other one. Well, I mean, when we throw that men's. factor in there. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> I mean I'm going bad gas. And the ones have a man create little <laughs> literal dumpsters. <laughs> <laughs> She a freak though. <laughs> <laughs> right. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. Let's with, be honest. I'm gonna go with the cum dumpster. The other, one, the other one's cold and calculating. This one's a freak, yo. <laughs> because how at she, least, I mean, how the, she feel about horses? <laughs> <laughs> Is that the interview? That was the interview. That was the interview, right? That was her. <laughs> she was. Does it. All right, now there, there you go. Now there with you this go. new information. Now with this new information, she's like a way big freak. <laughs> it's weird. She asked me how I feel about horses. The interview was. The dater. <laughs> oh, how are you measuring up to a horse? Yeah, it never says who. Oh wait, yeah, it does it. Nobody measures up to a horse. <laughs> no, haven't you seen the video where he does the math on that? Yes. No. Yes. Yeah, pound per pound. Yeah, yeah. It's like a horse weighs x amount of pounds and has this big of a penis, and so therefore it's like so many inches per pound, and so it's like if you calculate that into uh, your average man, it, it's like. You when only need like a, is it a five inch? Then you only four inch. Four inches to be hung like a horse. Yeah. Wow. It's like, so be proud, man. <laughs> <laughs> I can't be proud. <laughs> <laughs> Hang it. One inch off. Oh, man. <laughs> I'm three. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> so how do you feel about anal sex? <laughs> no wonder Austin was so familiar with yeah, it. That <laughs> oh, was that joke. on the last part? That I was on the last one, last huh? Podcast, oh, yeah. that's nobody's no. going to get the reference. Oh, yeah. I remember that. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> yeah. I wonder if her name is Chugs Bud. Mm. Chug. Chug's bunny. Oh, yeah. here, here's an interesting one. 
another clone one, and it's it's not sexual. If you oh. had if you had the opportunity to raise a clone of yourself as your own child, would you do it? Yes. No. Why not? Because you right. are a Hellion. Because all he'll do is grow up and take over your life. <laughs> Clones are always uh, a bad but idea. But you grow older as you grow older. Multiplicity. So. I like pizza. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, all he's got to do is get, all he's got to do is get mad at you one time, and then he's taking over your life. I'm putting my wallet. <laughs> I wonder if you'd love it the same. <laughs> Last like, calls. I, like, I don't know. I got, I got pizza, Steve. Yeah, I like pizza. I know you gotta go. Pizza. Here you go. Oh, one last quick one. Strip tease or streep? Streep tease. Streep tease. You and Meryl Streep. Gross. You're gonna have sex tonight. Nope. nope. That's Pass. right. Academy Award winner Meryl Streep and you. Doing the nasty. Oh, boy. What's on your mind? How you feeling about this? Nope. Uh, anything nope. but her? <laughs> where's the bag? Are we talking well, like Devil Wears Prada, Meryl Streep? It's going to take, like a, a bag it's take like a whole like suit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she needs to be in an entire body bag. <laughs> Ew, that's I, a totally different thing. <laughs> <laughs> it's called necrophilia, sir. <laughs> Oh, well, let's end this while we're behind. One more. <laughs> oh let's end this okay. while we're behind. <laughs> the peanuts in your hand. Oh, man. Shut up. You're in a plane, and the pilot has just announced that the plane's going down. What do you do with the bag of peanuts in your hand? What? <laughs> do, you, <laughs> do you enjoy them? Stupid. <laughs> Oh my god. That's a good it's, question. It is a good question. Oh, I've got a better one. Okay. We'll answer yours. Oh, I gotta find this question. You eat them. Do you? Oh, if the do you even, are you even thinking about If I'm about in the that hand, in if it's in my hand out of the bag, then I just. I ain't dude, I think peanuts. the adrenaline. Nah, they probably so, get thrown. I think the adrenaline would be so high, I would have peanut butter instantly. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Honestly. Like, I'd be I would rip it. <laughs> Probably forget they're even in my hand. It'd be yep. like one of those situations where you're like, where are my keys? And, oh, they're in my hand. Like, I, I think my hand would be clenched the entire time <laughs> that I wouldn't even realize. Yeah, I think you're right. <sighs> oh, throw my gosh. Like, <laughs> See, that was a good one. Oh, my gosh. I'm not going to be able to find it. Oh, here's one. <laughs> hey, what the F does the Little Mermaid smell like? Oh! <laughs> <laughs> The what? <laughs> the what? <laughs> Says, hey, what the f does the Little Mermaid smell like? Freaking Pine cones. A tuna. <laughs> That's a good question, man. <laughs> right? I don't like know. It, she appears on 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 the shore. Which hand? Yeah. <laughs> I think they both would smell different. <laughs> right. <laughs> what yeah. smells like if fresh a, ocean breeze? If a human woman smells like fish, what does a mermaid smell like? A human woman? <laughs> Steak. That's a good question. <laughs> All right, okay. I was going to keep this one for another podcast because I was trying to piece together a podcast around this idea of a podcast. So if you have similar awkward situational questions, seriously, they're hard to think of. Let us know down in the comments because I would love to do a podcast about this for real. Okay. So here's the question that I've wanted to ask you guys for weeks. Your wife has been kidnapped and is being held in a location 30 minutes away. Hmm. You are driving to rescue her. It's a warm night. Your windows are down. Do you listen to music on the drive? And do you enjoy it? <laughs> so what you're going to do... <laughs> <laughs> this is you're a gonna, conundrum. You're gonna be turning on some like some like anger the music. To get you that's where yep, my yep, yep, yep. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, dude. You're gonna use that music to fuel your fire. Beer for my horse. You know what you're gonna do is you're gonna turn on that. What is it? The the ride of the Valkyries. There you go. So happy. That's when you play right when you get there. Uh huh. Yeah. All right. All right. I. Yeah, I think I honestly would. Or would you but, like be quiet, listening and trying to think and process and run I, things? I, I think I would have do. music would on, but it would be very low. You know, it just You'd background be like, noise. Or you're gonna be slamming, you know. I'm going in slaughter. You'd be pre-gaming. <laughs> <laughs> that has a different meaning. But pre-gaming, what you're I mean, but do. it's a beautiful day. 
Your windows are down. Your hair's yeah. flowing through the wind. I mean, do you, you maybe throw on serenity? Spice Girls? I don't know. For at least ten of those minutes, you Listen, don't have to focus a full thirty. If I'm trying to look at the GPS, the music has to get turned off. So I think thirty minutes. I would probably like plan my <laughs> turn it down my so I can attack. See better. Yeah, exactly. I'd probably plan my attack for the first twenty of it, and then the last ten minutes, I would be like some. Pumped music, dude, like, dude, 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 dude. I just hear. <laughs> I'd be going in there, <laughs> guns hot. Throwing on some three hundred Spartans yeah. music. Do, 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 do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> or, I like or, it. Uh, what about a day to remember song? The fight. Oh yeah, oh, <laughs> second yeah. sucks. Yeah. I'd be playing, well, I'm going to miss her. <laughs> Was he there? <laughs> I got to buy it. <laughs> or, or are you driving the other way? <laughs> oh, I miss American power. <laughs> yeah, oh, that sucks. All right. Also, nice to you. No, I would be dead quiet, and I would be making sure everything's loaded. You're driving. I would be making sure everything's loaded. Nice. All right. That's it. That's a good one, though. Yeah, that is a good one. That is a good one. Yeah, I, I've literally tried stewing on that and trying to think of other questions. I'm like, it's hard, man. It's hard. Awkward situational questions are questions hard to think that of. leave you between a rock and a hard place. Yep. Yeah, that's a good way to put it. All right. Well, with that, we're gonna close. Are making the good best of a situation. Have. You're making. <laughs> I think we have put this on long enough. Yeah. Okay. That was a good fun one. That was that, fun. That was a fun one. So um, honestly, those cards were a hell of a lot different than I expected. Right? Oh yeah, that was weird. <laughs> right? But it was good. Yeah, um, Chugs Bunny. No wonder they were on sale. Yeah, that was freaking weird. <laughs> freaking weird. If you uh, enjoyed this, give us a like. Give us a share. If you didn't enjoy this, give us a like. Give us a share. <laughs> <laughs> we've got, we've go got plenty of other content that I know you will like. Tell right. us what we can um, do better. Yep, tell us what we could do better. <laughs> um, Never do that again. <laughs> <laughs> um, if you, you know, maybe even if you have some ideas on what you'd like to see on the podcast, throw them out there. Yeah. What's our like, hashtag? Chugs Bunny. Chugs Bunny. <laughs> two for two, Is baby! Chugs Bunny is one? our hashtag. We're turning a new leaf yeah. around oh. here. <laughs> we are going for Chugs Bunny on this one. Hashtag Chugs Bunny. All right. Chugs Bunny. So um, thank you for joining us. We love you. Um, definitely thanks for being a part of this crowd. Love you guys. Ciao. Bye. Bye. Love you.